We are near Schofield Pass. This is Mount Baldy, a northeast facing bowl uh, above tree line. As you can see behind me, uh, this bowl ran last night during the storm naturally. Um, it failed as a persistent slab on weak layers near the ground. And it looks to be about two or three feet deep up there, the crown. We're here in the middle of the bowl, just on the flank of the avalanche, and looking at the snowpack structure here. Um, as you can see, it's pretty deep. We've got right around a meter of snow. Um, this is a deeper part of our zone that sees more snowfall than some of the spots closer to town. And in this meter, we've got a couple layers that we're looking at. Right here at the bottom, these are some facets. These are formed during, we had October storms, and then a dry spell. And they got buried last week by a pretty significant storm. And that storm is about right here. It's kind of half the slab. And then this top, oh, about a foot is what fell last night. So there's a couple interfaces. We're looking at this layer right here uh, where that new snow fell. And then this, these weak layers at the bottom, those facets. So uh, something to keep in mind, this is our persistent slab problem here at the bottom. And we've got some wind slabs forming just in this upper foot of snow.